Hi, my name is Rachel Ewens. I'm a mobile strategist and I run the app blog, ladyappapp.com. And we're going to talk about a really robust, awesome drawing app called Sketchbook and how to get the circles off of the screen. So Sketchbook is a really robust app, but consequently it's got a lot of features that can confuse some people. So I want to talk about a couple of the different circles that you might see in the screen and how to deal with them. Um, so the first circle you see down here is kind of an anchoring point. It allows you to deal with your menus. You can't really get rid of it. So some of the other circles you might see are when you tap that, you have the brush control. So in different directions, it controls your brush width um, and other, other fine-tuned features you can use. Um, so to get rid of that, you're actually going to click the small circle again. Another circle that you might see is the palm rejection circle. So that's actually dragged up from here. So if you see a big circle with kind of a, a cross hatch in it, like that, that's palm rejection. Um, you can drag it around the screen and, and it's designed for you to rest your palm there so that it doesn't get in the way of your drawing. If you want to get rid of the palm rejection, you can actually tap down at the bottom again and it'll pull it back in. So those are some of the circles that you might see. You might see the palm rejection and you might see the brush controls, but both of them can basically be controlled by the bottom area of your screen. So hopefully that helped you get your circles gone from Sketchbook and opened up your drawing space. My name is Rachel Ewens, and this has been How to Get Rid of Circles in Sketchbook.